And now, I would like to welcome Her Majesty, Queen Rani Al-Abdullah, Chairperson of the Jordan River Foundation, to stage. Thank you, Randa. Zena is a little homeless girl. Her father is an addict. Her mother has abandoned her. Many of her close relatives beat her, reject her, send her out to beg for food. As she sleeps in the stairwell of the, their building, she knows what it feels like to feel unloved, unwanted. This little girl is only in primary school, yet she suffered a lifetime of misery. It is for children like Zena that we have come together because we know that no people, no culture escapes the trauma and tragedy of child abuse. I am proud that Jordan is the first country outside Europe, the first in the Arab world, to hold a Child Helpline International Conference. It is a sign not only of our dedication to ending the misery of child abuse, but also of your confidence in Jordan to serve as an example to other developing countries. Not many people can measure their job performance in unguarded sighs of relief. You can. With over 10 million calls answered each year, you have a lot to be feel proud about. Those calls prove that CHI is a leading light in the fight against child abuse, connecting young victims to circles of support, sharing expertise across borders, bringing an informed voice to global discussions. And your creative use of radio, internet, and text messaging means that when a child reaches out for a helping hand, CHI is there to offer it. It's been said that child abuse casts a shadow the length of a lifetime. Today, too many children still live under the shadow, their confidence destroyed, their trust in others fractured, and their ability to love compromised. Grown up, they often perpetuate the cycle, abusing their own sons and daughters. But we are here to shine a light on that shadow. We are here to break that cycle of sadness. Because their hurt is our heartache, their wounds are our scars, and their silence is our shame. In Jordan, over the past 12 years, we've championed the idea that protecting children is a responsibility for all, not just parents. In 2000, the Jordan River Foundation established Dar al Aman, which means House of Safety, the Arab world's first center to rehabilitate abused children. It's a haven where their healing begins with playtime, storytelling, and art therapy, where doctors, teachers, and caregivers repair broken families, all under a roof of relief, love, and care. Another first is our Family and Child Center, which offers schooling to children and parents, providing a sanctuary to solve their problems. The center leads the way in prevention today so that, so that there is less need for intervention tomorrow. Thanks to the partnership of CHI, the JRF, and all of Jordan's phone companies, we have another crucial tool for children in need, a helpline that has become a lifeline to the troubled. Now, children can take control for themselves and ask for help. Zena asked for help. Thanks to the helpline, she's receiving care and attention, and counselors are working with her entire family to change things for the better. Our helpline, just in the pilot phase, receives over 250 calls a month from sh children seeking soft assurance or swift safe haven. We need more children to get that help. We need more children's voices to be heard. With your expertise, we can expand this network, train more counselors, and ensure that no child falls through the cracks and into the shadows. We can rescue children and childhoods. We can shine a light. Thank you all very much.